Our program is based on survival of the fittest. The ones that raise a good calf every year and the ones that breed back are the cattle that make it. The genetics that are put back into the herd are from those cattle that rise to the top. Our cattle are managed in such a way that they're adapted to the natural environment. So what that means is that if a cow loses a calf to a coyote or to a predator, we don't shoot the coyote because he's a natural fixture in their environment. And instead, we get rid of the cow. We sell the cow. If the cow becomes anemic or her calf becomes anemic due to too many parasites, well, instead of spraying the entire herd, we get rid of the cow, we sell the cow. We look at a cow's conformation to make sure she walks straight. We leave the horns on the cow so they can protect themselves. There's a reason why cattle have horns, so we leave them on. We look at a cow's udder, make sure she has four quarters so the calf has all the milk that he can nurse. But we don't select for color. Color uh, is not important to our way of thinking. Having animals that can live and reproduce and raise a calf every year is what we aim to do because we're in the business of producing beef in an efficient and economic way. Our cattle are not animals that you have to push. They're animals that if you open the gate, they'll see it. If you're able to think ahead and make things easy, well then our cattle are very easy to handle. We've been managing this herd for 15 years, and now it's a herd that's well adapted to its natural environment. It costs less money to run, it takes less time to monitor due to the survival of the fittest philosophy that we use in selection and culling our herd of cattle.